this short video I will demonstrate to farmers how they can track uh, genotyping samples that they would have sent to the lab in recent times. So in order to do this, if you log into your ICBF account and go to the services menu and under services click on genotype tracking. So here is the genotype tracking screen. So we can see here on the left hand side we have all the tag numbers of the animals that would have been requested for genotyping in your herd. We can see the date of birth of the animals. We can also see the sex and the breed. And as well as that, we can also see the, the death date. If the animal has died, what date the animal died on there as well. As well as this, we can see the, the, ta the sample type that would have been requested. So whether it would be an ear tag or a hair sample. And on the right hand side, we can see the most up to date status for each animal's uh, genomic sample. So we can see here, there's a cohort of animals that have recently had their samples scanned into the lab. And we can see what date that actually occurred on by reading the, the date that's in the status date column on the screen. You can see here by clicking on a tag number down along the left hand side, we can see the parented results that have came back from the animal on the genotype. So we can see that this animal here is both sire and dam verified. And if we click on the genotype column, we can see the sample quality, how good the sample quality was. So in this scenario here, the sample quality was good for this animal. As well as this, if we click on the, the green genomic evaluation button on the right hand side of the screen, it'll bring us to the ICBF animal search where it'll show us the most up-to-date genomic evaluation for the animal in question.